students are introduced to the education principles of Edward Storch. He worked as a teacher from 1897, 1898 in eastern Bohemia, and later in Mostig, where he gained experience with severely socially neglected youth. He had to leave both areas due to persecution for his political activism. In 1903, he obtained a position in Prague, where he spent the rest of his life, except for a two-year stay in Bratislava after the war. At the heart of Prague's historical center, students are educated by lecturers and students. The typical historical building where students sat was used daily for education in the Storch era called Children Farm. Leiben Island, as a part of the Leiben district, has undergone significant changes since the 19th century. These changes can also be noted on historical maps, which are preserved, for example, in the archives of the Academy of Sciences and will be accessible to students during the activity in a photocopied form. The original sound is included. Students put together selected maps that have been cut up on which the historical development can be recorded the most. Subsequently, according to the attached materials, they will try to arrange these maps on timelines and evaluate the effect Leiben went through. Another part of the activity will be a look at period photographs where students can freely discuss the equipment, background and activities in period photographs and their inclusion in today's school schedule. Students and lecturers are moving to the following location, Strahov Monastery. In the archive, students will get to know preserved period manuscripts, an analysis of Storch's work and its significance for today, introduction by lecturers, general introduction to the creation of Edward Storch, working the originals with gloves, children's farm, letters to the children of Batosk schools, correspondence of the shelter in Bartoski schools, correspondence of the shelter in Bartolomejewska, correspondence of the school in Jindriska and other documents. Students take notes continuously. Thank you for watching our video.